Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're here, that means you want to see my daily skincare routine. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I use on a daily basis and what kind of works for me. I also have like different skincare regimens for when I'm feeling a little more like my skin needs a little more attention. So if you want to see a video on where my skin needs a little more treatment, you can go ahead and leave a comment down below. But this video specifically is going to be me talking or me showing you guys my daily skincare routine, what I do on a daily basis aside from when my skin needs a little extra treatment. This is just what I do on a daily regimen. I just woke up recently so I have not washed my skin yet. The thing that I always go for first is a nice gentle cleanser because I do have dry skin and sometimes it's a little more sensitive so I will use something that is more ideal for that. And I've been using a gentle cleanser every day. I recently got in my Ipsy bag. This is the H2O Keep It Fresh Face Cleanser. And it is also a gentle cleanser. And I've been using it the past few days. And I love it so far. It has not made me break out or anything. Or tamper with my skin. So I'm going to go ahead and use this to cleanse my face. And we're just going to go ahead and get into it. And with that, I do use a spin brush to clean my face and this is the spin brush from Vanity Planet. It comes with four different heads. It has two face brushes, a body brush, and a foot aloofa spin. So there's four brushes and it comes with everything for $30, you guys. I'm not even kidding. When I found this, I'm just like blown away because it's $30 on VanityPlanet.com and it works amazing. I think it works better than the Clarisonic spin brushes and those ones are like $130 so that's a little ridiculous when those don't even like spin like this one does. I don't know if you can see how it just completely rotates. The Clarisonic ones, they just vibrate and they don't really, I feel like in my opinion, I don't think they really do a good job at deep cleaning your pores. So that's why I, I like using this one because it does a full rotation to really get in those pores. So I'm just going to go ahead and use these two together. And we're just going to go ahead and clean my face. So with this, it says to apply a coin-sized portion onto fingertips or a soft facial brush and delicately massage all over damp face for 30 to 60 seconds and then rinse with water to remove it. I'm going to go ahead and do that for you guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and squeeze that onto my span brush. And then we're just going to go ahead and clean my face. And then also I will take a little bit more and just cleanse up my neck area real quick. It's important that you make sure your neck and your decolletage is nice and clean just like your face. So now that once we're done using the cleanser, we're going to go ahead and wash that off. And then we're going to go ahead and go to the next step, you guys. Alright, so you're just going to make sure to nicely tap your face dry. After cleansing, I like to take a something that's going to help cleanse my pores even more. So I'm going to go ahead and take the Skin Smoothing Polish from Marad. And I'm just going to go ahead and massage this all over and then rinse it off. And then after that, I'm going to go in with my Intensive C Radiant Pill. And this one has a little bit of tingle to it and it just really deeply cleanses everything. Adds some brightness to your skin. And this is also an environmental shield, meaning that since I'm in the desert, this is gonna help boost my skin in a sense, just because it's so dry here and I have dry skin. So those aren't the best combination sometimes. And just because it is a desert, there's a lot of dirt and it just gets all in your pores. So that's just gonna really help to cleanse everything. I like using several products just to make sure that I'm really cleaning my face and making sure everything's good, you know, you know, you know. This is like kind of like a gentle exfoliator. Just exfoliate some of those pores real quick. Now this one I'm not gonna drag onto my neck. I'm just gonna focus on my face for this product. 
All right, then we're just gonna go ahead and rinse that off real quick. All right, so after the pore reform, I'm gonna go ahead and use my Intensive C Radiant Peel, and then we're just gonna leave this on for 10 minutes, and it's gonna tingle. My facialist, she kind of bumped up this one. There's different levels to this specific one, I guess, and it's just depending on the sensitivity of your skin, what level would work best for you guys. Just gonna go ahead and apply that to my face, and then we're just gonna wait 10 minutes and wash it up. This one, I will just drag down my neck a little bit. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and wait 10 minutes for that to set, and then we're just gonna wash it off, okay? All right, so now that our timer is done, it's been 10 minutes, I'm just gonna go ahead and wash this off my face, you guys. So I'll be right back. All right, now that we have my face cleansed and now that it is treated, I'm gonna go ahead and tone my face. And with that, I'm gonna be using the Lancome Tonic Comfort. And this is suitable for dry skin. It's so amazing. This silky, soft, moisturizing formula gently tones as it rehydrates a sensory experience to leave skin clean, comforted, and radiant which it does those things that's why i love it so much i like it more than i did with the dior that jeffree star had recommended i think this is 10 times better it's so much more hydrating in my opinion and it is twice the product in the dior and it's only ten dollars more so that was another amazing bonus about this product so i'm just gonna go ahead and tone my face and with that i like using a brown cotton pad just to nicely dab it all over the face so we're just gonna go ahead and take the lid off and then we're just gonna go ahead and pour it a little bit on to the cotton pad i like to fold it in half just so i can kind of spread the product around the whole cotton pad so i'm just gonna go ahead and like fold it and move the product around so the whole pad is covered and then we're just gonna lightly dab our face And you know you did an amazing job at cleaning your face if there is nothing on the pad. That there is no dirt or residue, anything left on the pad for my toner to pick up. So that is amazing. That means we did a good job at cleaning you guys. So the next thing after toning is moisturizing your skin. You want to make sure that you have the proper moisturizer for your skin type. So if you're dry, make sure you're getting something that suits dry skin. If you're oily, make sure you're getting something that suits oily skin because the products for oily skin might not have as much oils and stuff as the dry products, dry skin products do. So make sure you're getting the right one for your right skin type. This is the one that I use on a daily basis. This is Celestial and this is from Lush. This is a vegan product from them and it is just so amazing. I love this so much. It is crafted with sensitivity skin in mind. This gentle blend of cocoa butter, vanilla water, and almond milk keeps skin hydrated, soft, and glowing. And I can't, this just smells so good, you guys. It smells so good. It almost smells kind of like almond milk. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply that. You don't need a whole lot just because this is kind of thick in a way. So we're just gonna go ahead and apply that all over the eyes. And then I'm gonna bring this down my neck as well. So now we just let the moisturizer set in. I'm also gonna spray some Josie Marin Nirvana Hydrating Treatment Mist and we're just gonna spritz this on. This is just a nice hydration mist to boost hydration throughout the day or whatever. I just like dousing myself with this just because it leaves a nice hydration. I feel like this works best when you layer it on top of a moisturizer just so it gives it that added wetness if that makes sense. Like it holds in the moisture longer. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the Josie Marin 100% Pure Argan Oil to my lips and this is a moisturizing oil and it's just this nice dropper so we're just gonna go ahead and drop a little bit on the lips and just let that set in. So we're just gonna look like a grease monkey for a little bit until everything sits in nicely and then you just have a nice fresh revitalized skin and this is my daily skincare routine now this is what i'd like to do more for mornings if you guys want to see my 
night skincare routine. That one has a few more products involved with it, some different products as well. I also use mask when I'm doing my night skincare routine. So if you guys want to see that video as well, please let me know and I will go ahead and film that for you guys. I won't post them back to back unless you guys really want me to, but I may post it in a couple weeks for you guys just to kind of have it spread out. This is my morning skincare routine. So if you guys like it, please should be sure to give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my video because I am doing a giveaway for 1k and I am giving away a Anastasia Beverly Hills Aurora palette. It's so gorgeous. I just got it yesterday and I already have the box all set up and ready to go for you guys. So we just need less than 200 subscribers to hit our 1000 mark. Also, I need every video at least at 100 views before announcing my giveaway winner. And you just need to be subscribed to me on YouTube and following me on Instagram to be qualified to enter my giveaway. And make sure that you repost my giveaway photo on Instagram. So that's it. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. And yeah, peace out.